Hi, I'm Richard, a professional admissions consultant, and over the last 10 years, I've helped tens of MBA candidates get their dream offer to London Business School. In fact, a whopping 98% of my candidates have received a place, which is nearly five times the 20% acceptance rate that this course offers. Now today we're just gonna go through four of my 52 tips amassed from my network of professional admissions tutors, ex-alumni interviewers, and ex-admissions professionals. Now LBS has hidden tips. There are seven probes, they call them, to check are you strong for this course? But they don't tell you them. So today for the first time, we're gonna give you just two of those seven to help give you a competitive edge. Now, number one is a realistic career plan. This MBA is on average for people with at least five years of work experience, although many will have over 10. And typically it's for someone who is a professional looking to make a career shift. But that's not enough to say. They want to know what specific desk at what specific company in which specific region are you going to be working with? You cannot be too specific in your application. Do your research, and I recommend a five-year post-MBA plan. What are you going to do immediately after graduation? What's the name of the desk and the role you're going to be sitting on and applying to? And evidence that you've already researched that and that they take MBA graduates because you'll be asked, does the, uh, does the company take MBA graduates for this course? Then who are you going to be managing and what are you going to be achieving? Which takes me to our second of seven hidden criteria. But before I do, if you'd like to get more tips working with a professional such as myself to boost your chances, you can contact us using the information on screen now. Now that second tip is related. Beyond the career plan, what is your mission statement? What are you going to achieve in your career? LBS wants to see leadership, positive social impact, what is a global challenge that you can use your degree and your career to help the world solve? They want you to be presidential in your application, to stand out and be the best of the best. Indeed, LBS's MBA is consistently in the top three and often the top MBA program in the world. So you basically need to be as talented as the president of your country. Now, number three from me today is where we start getting technical. There is so much information on LBS's website. You should be using university-specific knowledge. And I particularly recommend that you talk about the optional fourth term. Now, LBS is a business and four terms costs more than three terms. You don't have to commit to it, but by saying that you have a lot of interest in the fourth term, you are looking a little bit more financially interesting to them. And of course, it shows you've read the website. Now, there's also amazing opportunities, international projects, leadership skills, and all sorts of uh, work experiences that you can get connected to this program. Look through, and I recommend choose your elective modules and tell them in the application which electives you are going to be working on. I also recommend looking at a faculty professor. Open days are fantastic to go and meet them and then name drop that person in your application. If you aren't aware, you do not write a personal statement for this course. LBS got rid of personal statements, and instead you are asked to write between 10 and 13 short answer questions, detailing your career experiences and what you hope to achieve next. Obviously, they want to know what research you've done for the course and what you want to achieve in your course. They even test your networking ability. Have you been to any open days? Have you spoken to any student ambassadors? Is there anyone that would recommend you? So get on LinkedIn or look at the student ambassadors on their website, contact these people, make friends with them over a coffee or a virtual Zoom and ask if they wouldn't mind recommending you. They probably did the same before and they'll be happy to help you out because that is one of the hoops that could help you to get that competitive edge. Now, lastly, if you get through all of these criteria, the seven hidden criteria and their questions, you will be invited to an alumni interview. This is about a 45 minute test 
and it is very important that you research who your alumni interviewer is. It is fantastic to start off an interview saying, hi, I've seen you work at this company, that's a fantastic field, I've worked here and I'm interested to know how you got on. What a great way to start a conversation and come across as professional. It is also important to prepare uh, more questions for your interviewer and through the amassed experiences of my network, uh, we have amassed over 100 past alumni questions to help drill and prepare our candidates to excel and hit that 98% success rate. So that's just four of 52 tips that we have to help LBS MBA candidates thrive in the application process. Let's take the stress out of it. Let's help you enjoy it. If you'd like to work with myself or my fantastic team, please contact us using the information on screen now. We also have a exemplar statement and five pillars of any master's application, which you can subscribe to in the information box below. And if you can give us a like or a share, that would help out. You can also comment. We try to get back to all of the comments that we have to help you. You might well ask questions that will help other candidates as well. And why not next check out our tip on the seven hidden criteria to smash the LPS interview, which is also linked in the description below. Good luck with the application.